So now, um, Gabriel and Isadora, Isadora, I think she remembers uh, about uh, what happens, but now I'm gonna split you into small rooms. So today we have eight people, so I, I will just divide us into two rooms. And in each room, uh, some of you will stay here with me in the main room and the others will go to the, to the number two room. Uh, there you you can introduce yourself, like uh, say say about uh, a little bit about you, and then you can uh, choose the leader. The leader just needs to ask the questions and make it very comfortable and talking. And then you can start with the questions. You can like choose the questions or make some question, uh, create some questions. So it's very uh, uh, okay to you. It's open. And uh, in some like 40, 45 minutes, I'm gonna warn, uh, oh, it's time to back, but um, be comfortable with the time and explore the, the scene and be polite with each other. If you something bother you, if you don't feel comfortable, you can talk with me. And then uh, I think it's all uh, we can start. And let me see, any doubts? Gabriel, okay, you better say no. So let me see here. Um, put this one. Okay. okay I think it's a not. Mm. Okay. So guys, um, take take your time to talk and to don't don't worry if you're committing some mix mistakes in here we are to learn together and uh, enjoy the conversation and see you uh, but gabriel larissa and Matthew will stay here in the main room with me um okay larissa could you uh, start uh, about a little bit about you yes of course so guys i'm larissa i'm 25 years old i'm an architect i work with landscaping i live in rio it's near to ana clara in cabo frio but now i am at my parents house in Peroi. and i have a cat probably she will sleep at my bed but not right now, <laughs> but you can see her uh, in a Zoom. Okay, and what else? I think it's it's okay for now. Thank you, Larissa. Uh, Dalva, good evening. Are you there? Hello. Good e good evening. Is it your first time? Yes. Good. So welcome. Are you uh, nervous you. to talk? Um, a little. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be nervous. Relax. Breathe, and everything is uh, okay, right? Um, just to summarize the things, uh, talk and talk is a platform and a community where you can practice your English and your the language that you want. We are okay. not here to judge you or judge your English or to teach you. Uh, everybody's learning, okay, together. And okay. every meeting we have the, a topic to discuss about. And today we're going to talk about uh, dreams and sleep. So we have some questions. I'm gonna send on chat. Can you see? Okay. Okay. So I am Ana Clara and I'm the hostess on this meeting. And I would like to know a little bit about you so you can introduce yourself as Larissa um, uh, said, and then we can continue. Okay. Could, could you present yourself? Uh, Para me apresentar? Yes, yes. 
Ah, ok, eu não, eu não tava entendendo. Uh, hello, uh, my name is Dalvan. I have, I have 26, 26 old. Uh, I, I from Federal Street. Uh, I'm beginning English. E estou aqui para aprender com vocês. Ok, Dava. So, uh, thanks. Nice, nice to meet you. Um, Gabriel, how about you? Hello, guys. My name is Gabriel. I am 29. Uh, I am a 30 year old. I, my brother in the last month. <laughs> Uh, so uh, I I work uh, with the uh, technology field. Uh, I have 10 years in the field. I, I love my job. I am passionate for my area, and I live in São Paulo, Brazil. So I like reading books, and I fancy and enjoy watching stories and movies. And I'm uh, I have a girlfriend. I I, I like uh, uh, reading books and the other things. Yeah, is it? Yeah, thank you. Thanks for sharing. And Matthew, the Brazilian guy with the t shirt. <laughs> Good evening, everybody. My name is Marcio and Mary. And uh, I grew up by here and now. I live in São José dos Campos, on the side of São Paulo. And uh, I play music instruments since my childhood, my, my life. And so I, I like it so much to play contrabass. And um, I'm working right now as a leader. I have three children. I'm married and two doggy and how can I say no race, all right? And for me, it's very intelligent and doggy, no race. I don't know. And so I, I ride a bike with my children. I like make food on weekend with my family, different delicious food. I like the, I enjoy the moment uh, with my family because I consider myself a family person, right? And um, yeah, I'm studying English this year. Mm, that's it. Thank you for listening. Yes, <laughs> thank you, Matthew. So uh, we can start with the questions. And the first question is about, do you usually remember your dreams? Tell about a recent dream you remember. So I think it's a little bit difficult. Some people don't remember about the dream, but uh, Gab Gabriel, Gabriel, sorry. Do you wanna start? Yes, sure. Uh, so in my case, you usually, it is hard for me myself uh i nowadays i don't have a, a dream uh because it's so it's, it's so hard for me my my sleep is as sleep uh always and my my sleep is strong and when i i have a dream it is difficult for my re remainder in the last night, for example, in, or in the other uh, days in the past. It is so hard for my mind. And, but for my re remainder, for my re remainder one dream, I can make that, I can able for make that when I wake up uh, fast. And I I I remember in this time, but I waiting for uh, five minutes. I forgot always. 
Yes, this, this happens with me. Uh, I usually remember, but just in a period of the time, like in the morning. So if uh, maybe in the other day, I don't remember. So it's difficult uh, for me, I understand. <laughs> and for you, Martin. So I don't think so. I usually remember my dream, but uh, I remember every single day my goals. And for me, it's very important about this example, study English, all right? It's my work up every day, five o'clock and this year. Before, I, I don't, I didn't like wake up early. But I, 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 I usually like to remember my goals. From. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's better to remember about the goals because it's reality, right? <laughs> the dreams are just sleeping and dream. Uh, but okay, <laughs> thank you, Ma. Um, Larissa, and you? Uh, I can't remember about my dreams, but I know that I dream it, but I can't remember about that. And today it was funny because I take a nap after my lunch because I work from home today. And I slept it so deeply and I wake up, woke up so um, worried about the time and it, it spent like 20 minutes. So it's so fast was well, so fast but i i can i can dream in a short time but i don't remember <laughs> yes the, the the good things uh of uh work from home you can take a nap and i usually do this and uh i remember that i i dream but uh, I can't remember the, the context of the dream. And for you, Dalvon, do you usually remember your dreams? Uh, sorry, I don't understand. Vou ficar só na observação, não tenho um vocabulário uh, suficiente para permanecer na conversa. No, no problem. But okay. um, when you sleep, you know, you, you think about something. Do you remember about this, the dream? Did you get dreams? Okay, no problem. You can just listen. If you want to say something, just, just say here on chat and I will ask. Um, number two, so is, do you think that animals dream? Why or why not? I put this question because I have a, not my dog, but a friend's dog who dream. And it's so funny because it, he, he makes like movements uh, while he's sleeping. And I'm sure that he is uh, sleep, uh, dreaming. And Larissa, do, do, uh, you're doing this, so. Do yeah, help. I agree. I think so, because uh, sometimes I see my, my cat um moving or making sounds during the the, the sleep during the, the sleep and i i try to wake up her with um hugs or kiss to just for security protection you know <laughs> but i believe that yeah and you give her So I don't have a dog and I don't have a cat and in, in the animals. Uh, so in the past I had a a, a dog uh, five years five years ago and uh, I I I seen I I I saw uh, them I I saw it uh, the shake the movie when when he's sleeping you know 
and uh, I I I say that uh, yes, uh, already. <laughs> so yes, <laughs> yes, I think the same. I think they they dream. Uh, maybe uh, they dream. Uh, they are like eating a lot or trying to catch some birds or something <laughs> like this. Uh, and and for you, Marty, do you think? I don't think so because um, animals you don't have to worry, you know. And they are happy depending on the situation. Yes, and um, animal, for example, my I have to talk. No race and the name is Spike and Kiara. When I miss, when I miss, see, I don't know. And it's very happy when I miss. See. Yeah, it's very happy. But I, I, sometimes I fight, and I fight with it. There, I fight with there, so it, it's happy, it's very happy, depending on the situation, or happy or bad. I, I don't think so because uh, you don't have to worry, definitely, or causing definitely the situations, yeah, guys. But you can dream about good things as well, it's not worry. When we are worried about something we dream, maybe they are dreaming about something good. <laughs> yeah, it's it's my dream replace my body with my cat just for one day because it's a good life. Just sleeping, dreaming, eating, playing. <laughs> it's it's amazing. <laughs> yeah, if we could do this, um, I would like as well. Um, okay, number three, how many hours a night do you usually sleep? Would you like to get more sleep or less? So I usually sleep um, seven and a half or some days six hours when I have a lot of things to do, but I would like to, to sleep like eight or eight and a half and to have a, a good um, sleep and good night of sleep and yeah uh, i would like to have more and you gabriel so i love it like <laughs> uh i in my case i i need the seven hours you usually for uh, so feeling so good sleep for me for my pro productive in my day in my energy it is it's enough for for me the seven hours but uh sometimes i i have slept less or more because my daily is it's hard for for me my work is in the others topics in the others top in the others top topics um but but for for me uh the seven hours it's it's enough yes i don't know if you you all uh, feel the same but when i oversleep i feel more tired so mm -hmm. uh, it's funny <laughs> so we have we need a balance yeah uh, uh, Larissa and, and you. Uh, I use it. I use it to sleep to seven, seven or six hours per night, but it's never enough. <laughs> I always feel tired, and when I have to go to to an office, I need to wake up um, early, and I. When I work from home, I can sleep more. 
because I don't spend my my time in the traffic, you know. And at the weekends, I like to wake up late, like 10 a.m. And someday I will try the 6 a.m. immersions, but not now. <laughs> I'm not prepared for that. Yes, now we have the 6 a.m. immersions and it's it's a challenge to, to wake up. Philip is being uh, very strong to, to do this. I, I wake up like seven, sorry, six, six and a half, 6.30, but it's difficult to wake up and then talk in English. <laughs> and for you, Martin. About the questions, um, I usually sleep per night seven hours. I would you like uh, sleep more, but unfortunately, I can and I can sleep late. Yeah, it's my mind. I, is I don't know uh, English acostumou and uh, wake up early uh, this year and uh, but uh, Sunday to Sunday I I, I would like to uh, sleep more but unfortunately I can't sleep late. Yes, my dream is to to go to sleep like 9 p.m. and wake up like 5, 6 a.m. because I prefer to enjoy the day and enjoy the the morning. But I, I can't do this right now because college and because a lot of things, but my dream on holidays and on on my vacation, I do this, so I can like go to the beach in the morning. I I can um, do some exercise. So I I agree with you, Martin. I I need to 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 sleep early. The one do you wanna try this one number three? How many hours a night do you usually sleep? Okay. If you want to answer the question on chat, you can do as well. Uh, number four. Do you ever take a snap? So snaps. <laughs> do you ever take naps? If so, when? As I said, in uh, during the lunch, sometimes I, I take a nap uh, between the the oh my god the meetings. Um, and you, ladies, I think it's the same, but in other time, do you do? Yeah, I I work from from office for four days that week, so it's difficult to to sleep at lunch. But on the weekends. I, I like to take a nap uh, at the afternoon. It's, it's amazing, like 30 minutes or one hour. It's, it's great. Yeah, exactly. Gabriel? For me, take a nap, it is, it, it's so, so good in wake, weekends. In weekends, I, I, I got to make that. Uh, for one hour or thirty minutes only, but I I try and make make that in they they start more even uh, because in the in the evening or the the later it is so bad because my sleep it is can be long <laughs> and it is it is bad. Uh, for my night, for for my sleeping night. So, but uh, but in my way, in my week, during my weekend, my week, it is. I don't like make that 
because I I like to sleep and uh, in 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 the night only. It is better for me. Yes, for me, uh, it's the nap needs to be uh, at one p.m. two p.m. because if it's it's more than this at night, I can't sleep. I I, I sleep, but I I uh, oh I forgot the the word. Uh, but I I have this close to to sleep at night. Um, and you, Marcia? Yeah, I uh, take naps every day when I, I eat lunch after eat lunch and 10 or 20 minutes and so at night when I exhaust and because of the day and I take naps and I, I sometimes take naps is very good when I sleep. All right. I think uh, sometimes it wake up uh, good um, sometimes. But uh, yeah, take naps every day after eat lunch. Yeah, it's really good. Uh, number five, let's go. Um, are you a light sleeper or you or can you sleep on airplanes, trains, and buses or in anywhere you can sleep? Um, for me, uh, I am not a, a light sleeper. I can uh, uh, sleep in some different places. I think I'm too tired that I can't do this, but uh, some people has uh, this light sleeper and can sleep uh, and have difficulties at night to sleep. Larissa, are you a light sleeper or you can sleep in everywhere? Yeah, I'm a light sleeper. I can't sleep a full night in, in my house because I always... Uh, go to a bathroom or hear the noise, you know. But I, I am, uh, I travel every week because, uh, because of my job. So I, I have to, to enjoy my time on the bus, you know. And I can sleep at bus. I get it. Uh, yeah, we can be the both, right? We can uh, be a light sleeper and uh, sleep on some places. But uh, Matthew, how about you? My sleep is, is very heavy, but as, um, yes, but uh, I don't like it. Sleeping on the bus, on the train. And, um, for me, it's, it's difficult. And uh, about the I plan, train, and on the bus, I don't like sleeping. And, yes, that's it. Got it. Yeah, I went to Sao Paulo uh, in this weekend. And oh my God, I slept a lot on the bus. I just like put the 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 chair. It's not chair, I think, but uh, in a good position. And then I I sleep slept like seven hours, maybe almost all the the trip. It was really good. And you gave her. So in my case, I, I like to make bets when I take a bus or take a uh, driving. When I, uh, I, I was in the car, all, all, all the others always do. I like it, but I, uh, but uh, I, I don't make that. I don't got to make that uh, 
because it is it is hard for my mind because I don't see my mind don't see can be understand my moments my my time uh, for the sleep and it is it is can be confused in my mind and I don't gotta make that because it is hard for for my mind when I get out for my bed for my my bed yeah so uh but uh, i i i can try but i don't got it you know yeah it makes sense sometimes it's difficult to, to under, our mind understand what is happening um okay um Number C, do you prefer to go to sleep late or wake up early? I think Master said a little bit, so do you want to share again? I prefer wake up early. Yeah, it's because I enjoy the moment, I enjoy the studying and enjoy. Uh, my family, my dog, my mm, my play music. In, uh, in general, I prefer a couple early because this year uh, it's very difficult for me to wake up early. Before, mm, I don't remember and uh, wake up early. But this year, every day, wake up early for me. I enjoy the moment in general. Yeah, get it. It's my uh, goal to the next year to wake up early every day and enjoy the morning. Uh, Gabriel, how about you? I love it, wake up early, but it is hard maintain or keep consistent in, in, in every day, but I, I, I love it. So I, I can try uh, always because it is so good for my mind and for my body because I, I can be making, uh, I can be make exercise and I can be making reading books and I can be, I can be making what, whatever I want in the early because my mind's working better. Mm -hmm. It is it is it is so good. But uh, sometimes I I can go go to, go to sleepy later and later and it is it is bad when I make that because mm -hmm. I I my morning it is not it is it is good, but it can can be better when I I wake up early. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I feel the same. I think the the difficult to wake up early uh, is when I uh, sleep later. But uh, in the morning, uh, when it's cold here on my city, it's not cold at all the 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 year. But like in, in the winter, in some periods of the, the year, it's terrible to wake up early because of the cold. So I have this difficult. And you, Larissa, I think the, do you feel the same, right? Yeah, yeah. I, I prefer wake up, wake up, no. Uh, sleep late because it's, it's normal to me because my, my fiance work, work in a, a restaurant and He's arrived at home late after midnight, so it's normal to me to to sleep late to go to bed after midnight. I don't like to wake up early. Um, on on Saturday, I try to to do some classes or immersions, but it's a little bit difficult to think in English, even in Portuguese, but. In English, it's so hard, but on the on the travel in the 
in my vacation, I like to wake up early to to enjoy the day and visit some place, you know, just on travels. <laughs> yes, I get it. Um, let me see. We have number seven, eight, nine. Okay, let's continue with the sequence. Uh, number seven is. Have you ever experienced insomnia? What can you do to treat it, insomnia? Uh, what do you think uh, causes it? Um, Larissa, do you wanna start? I don't, I don't know if I have some experience of insomnia, but I remember uh, in my, when I did my final project at work, uh, I can't sleep very well and I felt nervous and stressful and mm -hmm. it was a little bit difficult to to sleep. And this is it's my experience. <laughs> okay. Yeah, and um what do not not can you how can you treat but uh why do you think you don't have insomnia? Like, do you usually do something special for to to sleep well in, at the night? No, I'm not doing nothing special, and I'm not an example because to follow because I always go to to bed with my cell phone. <laughs> I'm not an example. I don't know why. I think it's. It's my gene. It's my way to to life. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Okay, got it. And we gave her. So now, uh, for this specific topic, I I don't have. Uh, but in the past, when I I had, I I was a children. I I had, and. Uh, you usually I wake up uh, in the night uh, and uh, I I I am able for walking in my house uh, and uh, wake up uh, only in my bed and I I don't able for sleep again and it uh, it is hard but. Nowadays, I I have uh, so stress when I I I I go to 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 sleep and it's it's so so bad for for me. I I I have sometimes. Yes, I get it. And you can say sleepwalker when you was a child. You like you. Uh, the, the the description the description that you said uh you uh sleep but you get up and walk between the the your house so it's a uh, sleep walker yeah <laughs> and you must so i don't remember um uh, or i don't know all right it's Difficult, but uh, I think cause it cause it. Uh, I think it is tiredness, sadness, and of the day, or it could be um, hereditary. All right, mm -hmm. I don't know. Uh, it's years, it's years. I, I think. It, Hereditary and yes, I think it's some uh, depend the the cause, depend the the people. I I think your tiredness or sadness of the day working and a lot, for example, and or hereditary. Mm -hmm. Yes, I agree. I think can be uh, this the, the reason yeah of uh, insomnia. So uh, time is running. Uh, I'm gonna bring the others back 
but let let uh, answer the number 10. Um, if you could have an operation that would allow you to get only two hours of sleep each night, would you have it? Why or why not? Marcy is smiling, so would you? I don't think so, because um, moment and have moment in different day. I don't think so because days and I I don't like and uh, sleepy two two hours for example. Mm -hmm. So it's the moment, but uh, I don't call to have. <laughs> Got it. And you let it. Yeah, I, I don't think so. I don't think it's a good idea because I I have the necessity to sleep and feel good and feel relaxed. But it's always a good idea if you have more time to enjoy your day or do another things. But I I don't don't like this idea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um thinking here uh just two hours like it's during at night so usually don't have too much to do at night night is a time to relax and uh take uh sleep to rest uh, uh of the day before uh but if i could just sleep two hours but uh be relaxed uh, as eight hours maybe is a good idea of for this final of the year a lot of things to study and to deliver maybe is a good idea but in general I prefer sleep my eight hours and you Gabriel so it, it depends because if I, I can be sleep two hours and it, it is enough for 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 me, it, it, it is okay. But uh, for me, in my situation, my sleep it not it is not negotiate and not at all. It is uh, I I can be make that because in the past I my sleep is is less. Uh, I I slept in the last year are around uh, three and five hours per per night uh, because my work it was hard and uh, it just can be better for my health better better uh, mm -hmm. so bad sorry it is can be bad for for my health and uh, Nowadays and for my victory, my my sleep uh, may seven hours or more. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's important to understand what is necessary and important to us. So thanks for sharing, Gabriel. And the other guys are back. Uh, you're with a, a good face, so I would like to know if uh, about the the topic and the, the what you have discussed about uh, you can choose to if you want to share or not some volunteer Isadora, Thiago, Gustavo and Fabio well, was very good it was very good talking and about the questions everyone explain about what and stand it was good it was very good it's time Okay, and Fabio, uh, do you usually remember your dreams? Sometimes, sometimes, not always, but sometimes I remember. And when I remember, I like to search about to understand it too. Yeah, my, my connection is a little bit unstable, but I, I understand. Thank, right. Thanks, Fabio, for sharing. And Isadora, and for you, how was the experience to back to talk and talk? 
Ah, uh, very good. I was missing it. <laughs> and I think that Fabio don't tell uh, to you is that he likes to take a nap every day at the lunch watching the news. <laughs> yeah. And he does this. So I would like to take a nap every day like <laughs> Fabio. <laughs> Good, good one, Fabio. Here we share the, the same. I, I'm working from home, so I try to, not every day, but I try to do some, uh, in some days, uh, to take a, a nap. And oh my God, it's so good. <laughs> and you, Thiago? Isadora, I think that he, if you bear with Fabio to see that he... Uh, who who sleep more? I think that you you win, yeah. So yeah, you you like to to sleep. Uh, guys, it's a pleasure to talk with you in these moments in this class. Uh, it's a pleasure to to know. Uh, it's a pleasure to meet you, Isadora, Fabio, Gustavo. And uh, I think that our our talk and our conversation it's really good. And I think that we can we can uh, share our opinion and our and how to conduct how to, uh, to, con to conduct our life yeah it's it's great guys it's a it's a great it's a great uh, subject yeah and good congratulations oh, thank you thank you. i'm happy that you like it and this is the idea <laughs> uh, gustavo and you do you want to share something yeah, it was uh, interesting to talk about this topic. And I actually had a, another conversation about the same topic, but more focused on sleep, not, mm -hmm. not dreams. And it was interesting. Good. Thank you, Gustavo. I'm happy that you like it. And guys, uh, unfortunately, we have just three more minutes. So I'm sending here on chat the feedback. It's the link uh, for the feedback uh, you can like give uh, some suggestions for the next class and next talk uh, next week i'll be here at the same time so maybe you want to to talk about something specific so you can put there and i'm gonna try to create the questions and if you want you can create the questions as well so maybe you you want to uh, improve this part to 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 write things so you can put there, uh, no problem. And I'm gonna uh, read and uh, try to, to bring to us to discuss about. And so I think it's all for today. Uh, I would like to say welcome again to Zadora and Gabriel. So I hope you enjoy this moment and back more times. Larissa, Thiago, Márcio, Fabio and Gustavo as well. Thank you for your time and I see you next week. Bye bye. Thank you, Ana Clara. Bye, Thank guys.